Hello, welcome to Pantheon of the Geeks. You join us for an unboxing of Crisis Protocol, the Marvel's miniature game. So here we have um, Jean Grey and Cassandra Nova. So I've never heard of Cassandra Nova, so I had to look her up actually. Yeah. Um, and she's some sort of parasite that lived inside Lovely. Um, Xavier. Yeah. Even better, she tried to kill him in the womb. Well, it's, just, it's very dark. It's very she dark. Sounds like a, a she sounds like a person. delightful person that you'd really like to meet. And then obviously we've oh got Jean Grey, aka Phoenix, and they just can never get that film right at all. The Dark Phoenix saga. Just, just leave it. Just do it while she's planet or something. <laughs> leave it out. So there's the back of the box. So this one's one of mine only because. Jean Grey is one of my favourite characters, to be quite yeah. honest. Um, and again, this is from the 90s animated, mm. because you can tell from the hairstyle and the yeah. uh, costume. It's very, very 80-ish, 90s, when there was like power hair and... It's not wearing power suit, Probably, yeah. And massive shoulder. Massive shoulder pads, yeah. That you think, how do you fight in those? I don't suppose Jean Grey needs to fight, does she really? She's a think about it. <laughs> yes. Oh, so she defeats everyone, she just goes, uh, you are back. <laughs> so Jean Grey's first. Yep. So, I'm assuming that is the Jean Grey sprue. Cool. And. That is the sprue for Cassandra Nova. She has a stick. Yeah, she hits people. I don't have a sword on the box from the angle of it. it, it? It's just, it's it's just, just a, a scepter. Stick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know. Okay. Maybe she wants to be like Yoda. Yoda's got a stick. Just hits just, people. Yeah. yeah. Fair enough. <laughs> okay, cool. so Jean Grace first. Right. Uh, don't want to show off the cards yet. Yeah. Cards. I'm do that for us. Okay. So we have. Hopefully that's on camera. Gene three. Gene. Gene three. Yeah. Fair enough. I assume that might be for uh, one of the clones. And we have mental domination. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. So there's a whole bunch of X tokens. <laughs> And then we have uh, Ingra. So those are her abilities. She is sad. And Cassandra Nova. And there is the other side of that. Brilliant. Awesome. So, um, Claire gets the pieces off for Jean Grey. We should start putting it together. Yep. Okay, so Jean Grey. Mm -hmm. So we have the main part of the body, which is B3. Mm -hmm. And then we have the other part, which is B4. B4. And I suppose we've got like a six sided peg. So that sticks together there. And then we've got a head, B2 and B1. Mm -hmm. Again, there's a little peg. And that goes in there. Like that. Uh, this then is added onto the body, so I'm going to do that first. Seven. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to that. Uh, 
Then we have B5, which is one of our own. One piece. You can have very slender the arms. Yeah, well, they haven't decided to put it into two different separate pieces for some reason. <laughs> yeah. The mid arm is B6. Which kind of like got that up to a face almost. Yeah. Fortunately, there's pegs for the arms. She's kind of like, she's got it to a, a temple, hasn't she? Yeah, so she's like. She's doing the psychic power thing. <laughs> And then we have these two like blast waves. Yeah, they're like um, I don't know telepathic waves or something. So on the back of a car, there's like a little cutout. Mm -hmm. I assume that's where it fits in. I would say so. Yeah. It also, also there's a little bit of a quirk on her shoe, so I imagine she fits between them like that. Mm -hmm. So these two. Uh, Look like they go together. Looks like a bit of cardboard together. <laughs> Next. Like that, I'd mm -hmm. say. So. Yep, definitely. Yeah. So we'll glue them together and then we'll attach them to her mm -hmm. and we'll come back with the finished model. Okay. There she is, more or less. <laughs> cool. She's a bit awkward. Mmm. Best thing to do is get this X shaped blast thing onto the base. Right. And get it flat. Mm -hmm. And after about 20 attempts, I managed to get in a position where I could actually glue her legs on. I don't think it's in exactly the right position either. But it's as close as work. It's fine. Um, bit awkward that connection, to be honest. Mm. Because no matter how you put it, it doesn't really fit into this slot she's got in this leg. The foot one does, so it's a good one to line it up with, but then the other one doesn't. So yeah. Yeah. But she's on. She's on. Cool. She seems pretty sturdy. Good. So that's Jean Grey. Awesome sauce. So now for um, Cassandra. Got A2 and A3. And then you have A7 and A6. Then we have A5 and A4. Uh, A1. And then you've got this mushroom type thing. It's yeah. A8 and A9. And then I've got a base there. Oh, cool. And um, she's been drinking beer. Does she? Nice. Yeah. I'm actually going to put this mushroom bit together first. Yeah, I was looking at that, it looks really no, faffy. Yeah. The connector, I was. It's like a, a D shape. Yeah, it's a D shape, yeah. so it only goes together in one particular way. Right, mm. that can be drying. And hopefully, I'll just put that onto the base. Uh, rest hooks. Straightforward, very fast words. <laughs> uh, we have a peg there. And put that onto that. And then we have a pair of legs. And we should put those together and that was giving us a little peg. So just got a bit of McGuffin I'm gonna take off. Okay. And these two parts go together. Then we have a head with a weird scarf. Mm -hmm. and we have two arms. I'm going to put the arms on first. It's got the scarf. It's going to get in the way otherwise. So we have a twirly twirly cane.
I'm on first. Tell you what, she does remind me of a little bit a Matley phone model. Yeah, she does. She's a bit like a Marvel master, I think. Yeah. Definitely. Now you've said it. Yeah. Now we're going to attach this base. Like so. And she should go on that. We hope. Surprise! <laughs> Did not expect that to stand up. I'll throw the beer bottle on the. Uh, what about? Okay. There we go. Standing over and doing great. Interesting. Very. Quite a different model, actually. Um, both of them. Yeah. I, th I think Cassandra's really, I don't know, there's something about her that's like weird, almost. Yeah. Unreal. Like you say, she has that Malfoy-esque yeah. traits going on there. Yeah. Cool. cool. So there we go. So that is this video done. Uh, in the next video, we're going to be looking at Mystique and Beast. Mm -hmm. Another one of my boxes. Yes. So I shall look forward to that but for now please like and subscribe and hopefully we'll see you again soon see you soon